motivators we listed, job security, empowerment, <coughs> advancement opportunities, advancement opportunities, uh, success, <laughs> respect, integrity, a good work-life balance, uh, the quality of tools and equipment that you have. How important it was to manage that change. Awareness. So as leaders, what have you got to do? Awareness. Change, the, mindset. Explain change why. the mindset. Okay. Now, that sounds good, but how do you do that? I mean, I agree with you, but what are the keys to doing that? To believe it in yourself. Absolutely. To have some passion. Do I really believe it? Do I really, do I work it? Do I walk it? Okay. It ends with a C and ends with an N. Communication. communication. And it's over communicating. Employees who don't have information, guess what? They'll create it at, uh, at their own. And they'll create it behind your back, and they'll create it at the deficit of the organization. So you don't. The book in 1981 by Peters and Waterman called In Search of Excellence. And at Hewlett Packard, what they said was if you're going to work for us, you've got to get out of your offices and go out and spend time and ask questions. What's working? What's getting in the way? How can I help? And those of you at whatever level you're in in the organization, if you haven't asked that question or spent some time with men and women who literally have some tough jobs, they don't have nice offices, they don't get catered lunch, they don't get brought to beautiful Indianapolis, they're out there doing the work.